Miracles that take place every second in the universe. Let us go on a journey within the solar system. But let us also remind ourselves that some of the things we see as we travel between the planets may be rather frightening. There are temperatures as high as positive 475 degrees in some areas, pitch blackness in others, and an airless and waterless environment in yet other areas. Some regions are freezing cold to support life while in other regions we will encounter storms and volcanoes. In short, within eight of the nine planets and their 53 satellites in the solar system, not one heavenly body is capable of supporting life. Each is a dead and silent collection of matter. There's only one exception, apart from the rest, this one is the Earth. A brightly lit planet in a pitch black void covered with the blue oceans and clouds. It consists of light and moderate temperatures and vegetation unlike anywhere else in space, all of whose features combine in perfect order and harmony for the existence of life. The environment on the other planets is sufficient to show just how different everything would be in the absence of just one of the conditions existing on Earth. Together with all the measures, from its atmosphere to the nature of its surface, from the elements to its distance from the sun, our Earth has been specially created for life. Separate miracles take place at every point in the universe in order for this system to continue. This flawless creation of the earth is a great blessing from Allah on mankind. Allah reveals in many verses how he has specially created our earth for the existence and benefit of living things. I seek refuge in Allah from the accursed Satan. It is he who made the earth a cradle for you and threaded pathways for you through it and sent down water from the sky by which we have brought forth various different types of plants. Eat and pasture your cattle. Certainly there are signs in that for a people of sound intellect. We placed firmly embedded mountains on the earth so it would not move under them. And we put broad valleys as a roadways in it so that perhaps they might be guided. He who made the earth a stable dwelling place 
and appointed rivers flowing through its midst, and placed firmly embedded mountains on it, and set a barrier between the two seas. Is there another God besides Allah? No, indeed, but most of them do not know it.